go now fellas, here we go, with something a bit heavier. Kuru, oh, I've had a couple of these, well there's. We Heavy Scotch Ale, that sounds alright, 6.9%, that sounds even better. Have a couple of light beers first. Oh, I've got a bit of something a bit heavier, as you do. Well, I did what I said I was going to do yesterday, I um, sent an email to the leader of the Sudanese community in Melbourne and I explained to him the makeup of Australian people and I said um, a lot of us were, um, were prisoners we were white what we call Irish white slaves to the English mmm Oh, that's lovely. The New Zealanders certainly know how to make a beer. That's a ripper. Oh, that scotch flavour. Well balanced. Mmm. Very good. Sorry to interrupt the uh, beer tastings with a bit of a spiel. But yeah, I just explained to them that because I've been hearing all the time they're calling us white slave masters. Well, you know, a lot of the Australian people, they might look European, but a lot of them are Lebanese. There's Iraqis. There's Iranians. There's... Oh, there's everything. There's a big melting pot. And there's Chinese, there's Korean, there's Japanese, Vietnamese, Thai, Malaysian. And... Most of the Europeans run away from the Second World War, so they were running away from conflict. So that's why they came here. And most of them got, uh, well, suffered racism from the people running the country, which were the English. So my family, you know, I'm part Italian, so they got called wogs and spicks and whatever. And I got a little bit of Chinese blood, and my mum told me about, you know, her great-grandmother and grandmother getting called you know ching chong and slopehead and whatever you know and back in the day all those nasty things but they didn't even commit a crime and they suffered racism what about the Sudanese they're committing the most obscene crimes in Melbourne in Melbourne's history and uh, they're calling they've been wrongly educated they think that we're the English. Most Australian people aren't English. They've got to get that through their head. It's a melting pot. People mix together and they've all run away from conflicts or they've been brought here as prisoners and slaves. And they had to build bridges and they die and they just throw them into the bridge. So we've got bridges in Tasmania with blood coming out of the Irish, you know, Irish blood seeping out because they've been all thrown in there, building it. So don't call us fucking slave masters for fuck's sake. Anyway, cheers.